Hey guys, it's Bernard. I hope the glare isn't too bad right now. I found a really cool spot for my walk. I'm over in Asheville, North Carolina for his deposition. And during today, during the deposition, I started thinking about why I was there and what this case was about. And it got me thinking about what we do at our, our law office, our practice. And that's basically standing up for those people who need it representing those people who've been injured or harmed in some way and it's not their their fault and we need to, to represent them, represent their rights and doing the right thing. And that's, that's what I want to talk about for a minute. Doing the right thing is not always necessarily the popular thing or the thing that uh, folks can get behind. But doing the right thing sometimes requires a little bit of backbone, a little bit of thought process, and a little bit of trust in your own abilities and, and, and knowing that what you're doing and having a little confidence in doing those things are the right things for folks. Not that I don't need help sometimes, I need it quite a bit, but standing up for people who really need our help is the right thing. And if you believe in what you're doing and you know that what you're doing is the right thing to help somebody, it makes it all worth it. And I know that self-satisfaction or, or patting one on, on, on your back for doing the right thing, that's not what it's about. What it's about is helping a, a fellow human being, helping a friend, helping a family member, helping a stranger. And sometimes that goes against the grain. Sometimes it's not popular. Sometimes it gets you in trouble, or at least the, <laughs> it can appear to be. And in this case, I won't go into the particulars, but our fellow was hurt, it was not his fault, and we're pursuing a claim for him, and it is the right thing, and it what needs to be done. And he came to us asking for help, asking for assistance, and we're pursuing a claim for him in, in court, and we'll either try the case this fall, or it'll hopefully maybe get settled along the way, but it's the right thing to represent him. This was a guy who did not do anything to contribute to his own injuries and was hurt pretty badly. And that's all I'll really say about that. But that's, that's why I go to work every day. That's why I try to do what I think to be the right thing for folks who need it. And I'd love to hear from you all because I know there's countless examples that we could, could talk about, about doing the right thing that isn't necessarily popular. It's easy to go with the crowd. It's easy to be a follower. What's not easy is, is stepping outside your comfort zone sometimes and doing what you think is to be the right thing. And I hope you guys have a great rest of your Thursday and great weekend, and we'll catch you again next week.